Hello, Michael here from Small Robot Studio with a, another quick Redshift tutorial on how to render and interpret Alembic files. So if you're in Maya, what you want to do first is make sure that the Alembic read is on and it is a plugin. So you'll need to enable the ABC import and that will also enable the ABC export by default. Next, you want to go to your effects um, tab and you want to head over to cache and Alembic and then import a limbic and i've got this skull from the previous houdini tutorial which you if you're a patron you'll have the skull um, and if you're not a patron then you can join for at the five dollar tier and you will get this one and all other previous uh, tutorial assets okay so with our skull importer you'll see that Maya is already reading the point attributes um, from that so this has got point per uh so color per uh, point on it if we render it however I'll just chuck a dome light in there so you can see rendering it um, it's not picking up the color attribute from the points so we need to tell redshift um, in the shader where the color is coming from so we'll just apply redshift material to that and then we'll go into the hypershade editor and expand that one out then we'll get a user uh, data color. It's my heading tab, typing in that, and we'll run the out into the diffuse color, and then the attribute name is capital C, lowercase d, cd, which is your color data. So now when we render it, you'll see that you get the color data applied to it, and then it is just a matter of affecting your material as you normally would, and you'll get specularity and weight and all that. And because this is a black and white uh, essentially black and white um, color you could actually use this as a mask for all sorts of things as well that's it for this tutorial if you found it useful make sure you leave a like so other people can find it and if you haven't already make sure you subscribe as we're bringing out cg and illustration tutorials every week just like this one become a patron and access tutorial assets bonus content a private discord and more by clicking the link below